Hi everybody, I'm Jack Armstrong and I have self-published this book called Lessons from the Source, a spiritual guidebook for navigating life's journey. The response of the book has been wonderful, but there's one statement that stands out above everything else anybody has said, and that was from one of the reviewers who said, reading Lessons from the Source is like having a private one-on-one -on -one coaching session with God. And I think that really captures the essence of what makes this book so special. It is like having a kind, gentle, compassionate, wise friend or mentor who isn't going to be judging you, who's there to offer guidance and wisdom to help you through life. The book is a series of simple, everyday, easy to understand lessons about life and spirituality. And even though they're written in everyday language, they're profound and they're powerful. And a number of people have said to me that they felt the book was speaking directly to their soul. It offers real life analogies to help make points clear. And it even has specific techniques that we can use to help release negativity from our lives. And it's presented in, in small segments like this. Sometimes it's even one paragraph. And some people have referred to that as bite-sized chunks of wisdom. And it's something that you can use as a daily devotional or keep it by your bed on the nightstand or however you'd like to use it. Now, one thing I need to make clear to you is that I don't consider myself to be the author of this book. For more than 30 years, I have been receiving and writing down some amazing stuff that clearly hasn't come from my conscious mind. And for most of that time, I didn't have a clue what was happening. I fortunately saved it all, but I wasn't going to tell anybody about it. I mean, what would they think of me if I did that? Um, but there's been a gentle, persistent nudging over the years that's been saying, you know, you need to share this with other people. It's not just for you. Get it out there in the world. And I resisted that for a long time. But, you know, you get to a point in a certain age where what other people think isn't really all that important anymore. So I made the commitment to do the book. And after I did that, I found out what this phenomenon was that I'd been experiencing, and it's called inner dictation. And it's the same way that A Course in Miracles and Conversations with God and lots of other works over centuries have come through, and that's been very personally validating to me. And I now know that this is my life's work, to, to share this information that I've been given um, with other people who can benefit from it. You know, these aren't easy times that we're living in. And I think a lot of us would like to have that one-on-one -on -one coaching session with God, but perhaps the book can be the next best alternative. There's a lot of pain and fear and worry out there about a lot of things. I mean, people are losing their jobs and their homes and their lifetime savings. And I think for a lot of folks, it feels like everything's going wrong and they just want to make sense out of life. The book talks a lot about the challenges that we face in life, and it offers a bigger perspective that really is comforting and reassuring and can, can bring a sense of peace. This is also a time when many people are focusing on spiritual growth. Participation in organized religion is falling off, and yet I think people still want something to believe in and, and something to give greater meaning in their lives. For somebody who's just beginning to study this type of spirituality, this is a great introduction. It's easy to understand, it's, it's very comprehensive, and is a good foundation for further study. For those of us who've been on this path for a while, we're always looking for new interpretations of that one spiritual truth and new perspectives that can be helpful to us. And this is some really good stuff. And it's the kind of book that you often can just open at random and find exactly what you need. There are a number of places you can go to find out more about the book. There's a website, LessonsFromTheSource.com, that has a lot of excerpts and reviews and other information. I'm on Facebook and on Twitter, and on Facebook there's both a group and a fan page for the book. I've begun working on an audio book, which a lot of people have been asking for, and we'll be doing some ebooks on specific topics with information from this book that will be helpful in the future. And after 30 years, there's still a lot of information that nobody's ever seen that, you know, hopefully there'll be a way to, to get out to you in the future. I think you're going to find this to be a really important book in your life. And I hope you'll get yourself a copy. And I hope you'll also vote for it in the competition. Now, technically, you need to vote for me. But think of yourself as voting for the book because it's what deserves all the accolades. Thank you very much for listening. Check out the book. Many blessings.